Okay, good afternoon, my dear students. How are you? Okay, some of you have come here. Can you listen to me clearly? Yeah. Stop saying I wish and start saying I will. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you. Walaikum Aslam. Uh, Tasin. Walaikum Aslam Baba. Maruf. Hi. Maruf Muntaha. I'm fine. Alhamdulillah. Salamia. Walaikum Aslam Baba. Jami. Walaikum Aslam. Radhi Sami. Walaikum Aslam. So, how are you? Khushed. Uh, Kaji. Farad. Ahmed. Walaikum Aslam. Walaikum Aslam. Right. Okay, so uh, let's start the class here. Tomar kemon achu shobai? Yes, we are fine. Thank you. How are you passing your days? So fine. Thank you very much. <laughs> Okay, no problem. So let's start the class. Ask a class take to uh to Shundo Kore Shaji. I think you all will enjoy the class, right? So let's start the class and uh, uh, why are you always late? <laughs> Actually, uh, he, the total setup takes a lot of time. Uh, that's why uh, probably I was late today again. Uh, no problem. I'll just finish the class uh, within three ten o'clock and uh, Let's start there here. You see stop saying I wish I wish means actually I desire for doing something not to uh, Not to say that uh, you should not say in that way, but start saying I will I will that means I will do it or I will do the work not I wish to do the work uh, suppose I will uh, get the highest marks in the test so you say I will test get the highest marks in the test don't say I wish I would get the highest marks in the test okay that is an expectation but I think uh, but you should not wish for anything rather you think that you will do that probably this is my advice this day okay uh, <coughs> you can join uh, a bit of animation all right thank you i'll try uh, actually this is uh, the very first time so i'm just going Achha, thank you baba apna class one bhaal lage, okay <coughs> then uh, okay let's start here uh, one thing that i will just discuss about really that is, that is very interesting and today i will just give you some of the very important tips that you will enjoy of course and what is that about let's see suppose you want to go on a picnic with your friends and of course why do you want to go there uh, want to go uh, with your friends to the picnic because it is really very awesome and excellent uh, you can enjoy there right and this is the scenery because you can enjoy your time yourself uh, that's why you want to uh, you want to go there right now the question uh, you must take the permission of your parents for that okay if you want to go outside of home so for that you must take the permission from your parents now the question uh, you asked your friend asked your parents for the permission but they did not give it uh, to you right uh, they did not give it to you now your class will start at two o'clock not uh, 1 45 baba your class will start two two o'clock and it will uh, continue for one hour that means three Okay, and then uh, now the question you ask your parents for that, but uh, yes, the parents grew angry and uh, they said that no, 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 you cannot go alone, right, with your friends. Now the question, what will you do now? Okay, uh, please write down uh, your uh, thinking about that. So, what will you do now? Ramisa, thank you, Baba. So, now write down what will you do now. Uh, whenever your parents will not give you permission for going outside with your friends so what will you do then
I'm sorry, it to the mother is kinta tick or the chest I would see. Okay. So now please write down what will you do then. Talk on Ashley to me key court the chow key core how will you get the permission? Screen take to borrow for the so that you can see it properly. Proper probably you can understand that I will not go outside with my friend. I will say again. Okay, I will beg for permission. That's great. So everyone, uh, what you what will you do now? So actually, key court the chow or how can we get the permission of your parents? The Baba Mark has to give her permission. Are they called a So can you please write down that? I will request my parents for that. Uh, try to console them and call my nearest friend's mother. Okay. Okay, let's see. Uh, uh, let's see uh, the thing. Yes, absolutely. Probably uh, you will stay at home and even very sad. You will not go outside as you have already told that I have nothing to do. That's that's the right thing. Uh, whenever your parents do not give permission to you. So in that case, uh, you have nothing to do or nothing to say. So of course, you will have to endure that. All right and perhaps you will stay at home and we will play games and uh, just uh, whatever you like you will do that okay and then or you will just sleep at home and nothing else now the question now the question you will do it whenever your parents will not give you permission to go outside with your how will you just persuade that make your parents agree আমরা খুব সহজেই আমি আর একটু বলছি যে আমরা খুব সহজেই বাবা মাকে কিভাবে রাজি করাতে পারি আমার প্রশ্নটা হচ্ছে সেটা যে হাউ টু কনভিন্স প্যারেন্টস টু গো টু গো অন আ পিকনিক ধরে নাও যে তুমি একটা পিকনিকে যেতে চাও তো এখন প্রশ্ন হচ্ছে যে হাউ ক্যান ইউ কনভিন্স ইউর প্যারেন্টস টু গেট দ্যাট পারমিশান তোমার বাবা মাকে কিভাবে তুমি কনভিন্স করবে যে না আমার এই পারমিশানটা খুব প্রয়োজন এখন তুমি প্রতিবারই এভরি টাইম ইউ আর অ্যাস্কিং ফর দ্য পারমিশান টু ইউর প্যারেন্টস অ্যান্ড দে আর রিফিউজিং ইট না দ্য কোয়েশন হাউ উইল ইউ পার্সুয়ার ইউর প্যারেন্টস টু গিভ দ্যাট পারমিশান কীভাবে ইউ টু জাস্ট থিঙ্ক ইট হাউ ইউ ক্যান ইজিলি কনভিন্স ইউর প্যারেন্টস ফর দ্যাট পারমিশান ওকে প্রবলি ইউ আর থিঙ্কিং সো লেট সি হাউ উইল উড আই ম্যানেজ ইট যদি আমি তোমাদের জায়গায় থাকতাম তাহলে আমি আসলে কী বাবা আমাকে কনভিন্স করতাম তো তোমরা অবশ্যই এই পদ্ধতিগুলো অবলম্বন করতে পারো যেটা আসলে সবার জন্য হয়তো যেহেতু অ্যাজ আই এম অলসো প্যারেন্ট আমিও বাবা সো ইন দ্যাট কেস অ্যাকচুয়ালি আই থিঙ্ক দিস প্রসেস অর দ্য দিস সিস্টেম অর দিস থিং উইল বি অ্যাপ্লিকেবল টু ইউর প্যারেন্টস অ্যাজ ওয়েল ওকে সো আমি যেটা করতাম সো লেটস সি দেন সো ফার্স্টে সাপোজ আই call my parents and uh, uh, they say that no 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 i'm sorry dear you cannot go outside home alone with your friends okay so in that case uh, uh, first of all i mean just a quote them the beef goes to parents i would note down about the important importance of my going out ami je bondhuder sathe baire jabo ebong picnic e jete chai ei picnic e gele amar ki hobe amar what will be the benefits that i'll get first of all i i would note it down prothome ami ki kortam eta ashole note kore nitam je ki ki important points royeche jemon strengthening friendships creating new experiences learning how to host friends in my home so এই যে বিভিন্ন জিনিসগুলো আই উড রাইট ডাউন অল অফ দিস পয়েন্টস টু গ্যাদার ঠিক আছে দে দিজ আর দি ইম্পর্টেন্স অর দিজ আর দ্য বেনিফিট অফ গোয়িং আউটসাইড অর গোয়িং টু দ্য পিকনিক প্রথমে এই কাজটা করতাম লেটার অন আই উড ডু দেখো যে প্রথমেই জাস্ট ইফ ইউ উড নট ইট ডাউন অ্যান্ড জাস্ট ইউ গো স্ট্রেট টু ইউর প্যারেন্টস অ্যান্ড কল দেম নো বাবা ইউ হ্যাভ টু গিভ ইট পারমিশন নো ইফ ইউ ডু ইন দ্যাট ওয়ে ইউ হ্যাভ বিহেভ ইন দ্যাট ওয়ে প্রবলি ইউর প্যারেন্টস উইল নট গিভ ইট দ্যাট পারমিশন রাইট সো ফার্স্ট থিং দ্যাট ইউ উইল হ্যাভ টু ডু ইউ উইল প্লিজ দেম তাদেরকে কি করতে হবে বাবা মাকে সর্বপ্রথম যে কাজটা করতে হবে তাদেরকে খুশি করতে হবে কোনো না কোনো একটা কাজ বা কোনো না কোনো একটা কথা দিয়ে তাদের মনটাকে জয় করতে হবে জয় করার পরে তারপরে তোমার রিকোয়েস্টটা প্লেস করতে হবে ফার্স্ট থিং যেমন ধরে নাও যে ইন দ্য পিকচার ইজ ইউ সি যখন তোমাকে কিছু খেতে দেয় তুমি তখন খেতে চাও না হ্যাঁ যেমন তোমার এক গ্লাস দিচ্ছে বা বিভিন্ন কিছু খেতে দিচ্ছে হ্যাঁ সামটাইমস ইউ ডো নট লাইক দেম তো তুমি অন্তত কিছু দিনের জন্য কয়েকটা দিনের জন্য অন্তত এই রিকোয়েস্টটা প্লেস করার আগ পর্যন্ত তোমাকে বাবা মা যে জিনিসগুলো দিবে খেতে দিবে বা যা কাজ করতে বলবে ইউ উইল ডু দ্যাট ওকে তারপরে তুমি যখন এই কাজগুলো করবে তখন তাদের মনটা একটু সফট হবে ফার্স্ট সেকেন্ড থিং 
তো বাবা মাকে আবার এটা বলো না তাহলে কিন্তু ওরা আবার জেনে যাবে হ্যাঁ আচ্ছা সেকেন্ড থিং হচ্ছে যে বাবা মার সাথে বসে বসে চুপি চুপি গল্প করতে পারো মজার মজার বিষয় নিয়ে আলোচনা করতে পারো কথা বলতে পারো ঠিক আছে তাতে করে বাবা মার মনটা একটু সফট হবে তোমার প্রতি এবং সব সময় যদি তুমি ডিসএগ্রি করো তাদের সাথে শাউট করো তাদের সাথে কথা না শুনো তাহলে কি হবে তারা কিন্তু তারা কিন্তু তোমাকে অ্যাকসেপ্ট করবে না তোমার কথা অ্যাকসেপ্ট করতে চাইবে না রাইট সো ফার্স্ট অফ অল তুমি তাদের বাবা মার সাথে খুব একটু ক্লোজ হও রাইট ক্লোজ হওয়ার পরে দেখতে পাচ্ছ ছবিতে সুন্দর করে গল্প করছে মজার কিছু গল্প বলে মজার কিছু কথা বলে বাবার খুব কাছে চলে ভিতরে ঢুকে পড়ো রাইট তারপরে কি করবে এবার তুমি হয়তো বাসার কিছু অ্যাক্টিভিটিস আছে সেইগুলো তুমি করে দিতে পারো যেমন মনে করো যে আজকে খাবার খেয়েছো তো প্লেটটা ধুয়ে রাখলে ঠিক আছে বা আজকে দেখলে যে আম্মু খুব ব্যস্ত হয়তো ড্রয়িং রুমটা একটু ময়লা আছে বা পরিচয় অপরিষ্কার আছে বা তোমার পরের টেবিলটা অপরিচ্ছন্ন আছে বা সুন্দর করে তুমি সেগুলো মুছে মুছে মানে পরিষ্কার পরিচ্ছন্ন করে রাখলে বাবা মা খুব অবাক হবে হাই হাই এখানে দেখতে পাচ্ছ ছবিতে মা খুব অবাক হচ্ছে সে যখন প্লেট ডিশ ওয়াশ করছে সো সে খুব অবাক হচ্ছে হ্যাঁ তো তুমি এই ধরনের কিছু কাজ করে তাদের মনটাকে জয় করে নিতে পারো রাইট অ্যান্ড লাস্ট অফ অল ইউ উইল হ্যাভ টু ফাই হ্যাভ টু গো ফর হ্যাভ টু লুক ফর আ সিচুয়েশন তারপরে তোমাকে এমন একটা সিচুয়েশন বের করতে হবে ওয়াইন ওয়ার ইউর প্যারেন্টস আর ইন এ গুড মুড একটা ভালো অবস্থায় আছে বাবা মা যে একটা সুন্দর একটা অবস্থায় আছে সেই রকম একটা গুড সিচুয়েশন ইউ হ্যাভ টু ফর দ্যাট অ্যান্ড দেন অ্যাট দ্যাট গুড সিচুয়েশন দেন ইউ উইল জাস্ট এক্সপোজ Uh, your request or your uh, you what do you give our market but tomorrow you cost a place for the that only how to our man can to share any of how they want to show you about my city in the world who positively have been right so I think uh, tips and tricks to manage <laughs> parents for going picnic right the, uh, thank you very much after only get your right uh, <laughs> make them happy go see with them right agree with them and look for a perfect situation situation right absolutely right thing so in this way you proceed then of course you will be successful for that right so this is a secret tip for you you must not disclose it to your parents right and uh, just uh, use it and apply it probably tumar shudhumatro picnic e jawar kotha hai na je kono dhoroner jinish gulo tumi jodi baba mar kach theke adai korte chao ba pete chao of course you will get that ha tahole seta kintu tumi in this way you can you can get that right তাহলে এইভাবে তুমি কিন্তু খুব সহজে পেয়ে যেতে পারো ও সরি খুব সহজে পেয়ে যেতে পারো ওকে সো টিক্সটা কেমন লাগলো তোমাদের ডি ইয়ার্স probably probably right yeah, probably uh, my son sometimes uh, do this and uh, i have actually learned all these techniques or processes from my children right thank you very much all <coughs> uh, right uh, then uh, this is one technique technique by who you can just easily convince your parents for doing anything for getting anything right probably i hope so then uh, we'll go for next next question for you what to do if your parents leaves you alone on the road suppose you uh, have gone with your parents uh, to visit some place okay kono jaygay giyecho bondhur sathe berate to it so happens that uh, actually on the way uh, the, you had a quarrel with your parent with your friends and uh, actually he left or she left you right the, on the way so what, what will you do then আসলে তখন তুমি কি করবে ধরে নাও যে তোমার বন্ধু তোমাকে রেখে চলে গেল সো ইন দা অ্যাট দ্যাট সিচুয়েশন হোয়াট উইল ইউ ডু রাইট প্রবলি ইউ কিপ অন রাইটিং অ্যান্ড ইউ ইউ আর জাস্ট অ্যালোন অন দ্য রোড রাস্তায় একা একা ইউ আন্ডিং অ্যালোন দেয়ার অ্যান্ড হোয়াট উইল ইউ ডু নাও আই উইল গো টু দ্য পুলিশ স্টেশন অ্যান্ড দেন আই উইল কল দেন ওয়াও দ্যাটস গুড সো এনি আদার থিং হোয়াট উইল ইউ ডু I'll go home and uh, pass this my pillow. <laughs> That's good. Okay, any other thing do you want to do? Right. Uh, you have to go home, right? That's the safest place for you. Whenever you have a quarrel on the way with your friends, then you have to go home first, right? So you can take any public vehicle, right? You can take any public vehicle and you can go there. Or you will just wait. on the road for taking a trip uh gonna trip you know wait curve uh if someone uh, going passing by right with a car uh, like that so you will just stop him and say please uh give me a lift okay so you can do that if you are lucky enough you can get it okay 
uh, otherwise uh, so first of all the thing that will uh, you will have to do you will have to do you will just uh, safely you will have to reach home bashay pouchate hobe prothomoto nirapode right tar pore je kaaj ta korte hobe ekhon kintu you will be so angry as you have said you will just punch the pillow right so probably you will be in that mood ওকে আফটার রিচিং হোম বাসায় যখন পৌঁছাবে তখন তোমার চেহারাটা ঠিক এরকম হবে বিকজ আই হ্যাভ জাস্ট বিন কোয়ারেল জাস্ট কোয়ারেল উইথ ইউ ফ্রেন্ডস সো ইন দ্যাট সিচুয়েশন হোয়াট ইউ উইল ডু উইল ইউ টেল ইট টু ইউর প্যারেন্টস অর নট হোয়াট উড ইউ ডু আই আম গিভিং ইউ টু অপশনস সো ইউ উইল জাস্ট রাইট ইট ডাউন সো উইল ইউ উইল ইউ নট শেয়ার ইট উইথ ইউর প্যারেন্টস এটা কি তোমার বাবা মার সাথে তুমি সেটা শেয়ার করবে না করবে না ঠিক আছে ফার্স্ট থিং যে না বা আমার বন্ধুর সাথে ঝগড়া হচ্ছে আমি মন খারাপ করে বসে থাকবো সো আমি আমার বন্ধুদের সাথে শেয়ার করব না সো সেটা কি সেটা হবে আর ইউ উইল জাস্ট টেল ইট টু ইউর প্যারেন্টস অথবা বাবা মার সাথে সেটা শেয়ার করবে দেখি কে কোন কাজটা করতে কে কোন কাজটা করতে বাবা মার সাথে শেয়ার করতে কে আর হচ্ছে যে বাবা মার সাথে শেয়ার করতে না কে সো লেট সি প্লিজ রাইট আউন নো 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 ইউ উড নট তা সিন ইউ উড নট শেয়ার উইথ উইথ ইউর প্যারেন্টস রাইট সো হু উড শেয়ার এখানে আই হ্যাভ গিভেন ইউ টু অপশনস পার হ্যাভস ইউর মুড ইজ দ্যাট ইন দ্যাট মুড ইউ আর ইন দ্যাট মুড সো নাও হোয়াট উইল ইউ ডু উইল ইউ উইল ইউ টেল ইট টু ইউর ফাদার ও মাদার অর উইল ইউ নট টেল ইট টু ইউর ফাদার মাদার ওকে শেয়ার উইথ মাই প্যারেন্টস রাধি সামি লিখেছ ইয়েস আই উইল শেয়ার শেয়ার দিস উইথ মাই ওর প্যারেন্টস দ্যাটস গুড আমি শেয়ার করবো দ্যাটস গুড ওকে থ্যাংক ইউ অ্যান্ড প্রবলি দ্যাটস বেটার টু শেয়ার রাইট দ্যাটস বেটার টু শেয়ার অ্যান্ড দেন ইফ ইউ শেয়ার হোয়াট উইল হ্যাপেন দেন ইফ ইউ শেয়ার ইউর অ্যাঙ্গার ইফ ইউ শেয়ার ইউর সরোজ প্রবলি ইউর ফ্রেন্ড হ্যাজ শক ইউ হ্যাভ গট লট অফ সরোজ ফ্রম হিম ওর হার রাইট সো নাও দ্য মোস্ট ইম্পর্টেন্ট থিং will have to do is to show parents okay and if you share it with your parents tahole ki hobe then your sorrows will lessen down right tumar dukho ta ki hobe kome jabe tai to abar amader anondo tomar bondhur sathe tomar onek mojar golpo hocche ajke tahole shetao ba the share tahole share korle ki hobe tahole shetao anondo ta bere jabe tahole amader ami je jinish ta bojhate chechi je amra jokhon share kori whenever we share something like our sorrows we share then our uh, sorrows lessen amader dukho ta ki hoy kome jay and whenever we uh, uh, we share our happiness with others jokhon amader anondo ke amra share kori tokhon anondo ta abar ki hoy jay bere jay so probably you can understand that our today's lesson is that okay and that is the lesson probably you can understand understand it so let's go and uh, can you just guess today what is your topic amader topic ta ki hote pare tumra ki guess korte parcho yes uh, uh, you can right probably yes our topic is uh, about that boy who is very sad who is very sad and probably you know the name of that boy you know it what is the name of that boy from your book <coughs> probably you know right uh you uh, know the boy and he is farabi right he is farabi so we will say we will just uh, here go for this lesson and that is a sad day for farabi a sad day for farabi and it is from your unit lesson one and in this unit we will see that uh, farabi had a very bad experience sad experience uh, that he had had uh, from uh, his friends tar bondhur kach theke she ekta dukher sriti pechilo ebong she porobortite sei dukher kotha ta jokhon share koreche flora sathe tokhon tar ashole dukho ta kome esechilo right so probably uh, you can understand that today our lesson is that okay so let's see yes some of the keywords are there so look at the look at the boy look at the boy and how is the boy and what is his hair like is the each letter chulta kemon can you describe the describe the hair of this boy uh, can you describe please a sad day for far that's good that's good afton so uh, look at the boy and just uh, describe uh, his hair using a word ruffled bokate <laughs> right 
No, I just uh, I just did not uh, tell you to describe the boy using an adjective. I simply told you to use an adjective to describe his hair. Okay. That children describe what the volatile. And Raphael is the right answer. Raphael and Auntie, you can also write in. That's good. So our today's word is Raphael. Raphael is the word. And here you see Raphael means unbrushed or uncombed. Sometimes you also remain in that situation. The hair of the boy is ruffled. Okay. Uh, addicted. No, no, no. Addicted, not that, uh, actually. So, uh, I just uh, told you to describe the hair of the boy. And the hair of the boy is ruffled. Ruffled means unbrushed or uncombed. And you can understand. And here, the one sentence for you is here. The, the boy, the hair of the boy is ruffled. Uh, hair of the boy is, hair of the boy is ruffled. That's good. And then the next word. So, uh, is this uh, picture familiar to you? So what the picture about? So can you describe the picture? Can anyone of you? What do you think about this uh, picture, right? So what the picture about? So what do you think about this picture, right? Okay, you can see the screen clearly. His hair is ruffled and anti. That's good. That's good. Thank you very much. <clears throat> right. Coronavirus. A safety. Uh, uh, right. Coronavirus. Wearing masks to be safe from coronavirus. That's good. That's wonderful, Afnan. Right. So the word that will just uh, I will show you here is insist is the word. And probably uh, doctors are insisting us nowadays to wear masks to prevent coronavirus. And that's why the word is here. The picture is there. And you can understand that insist means to say firmly or persist. Okay. Jor. Okay. Uh, I'm there. Uh, insist. So here you see insist means to say firmly or persist. Okay. Uh, and you can understand doctors are insisting us to wear mask to prevent coronavirus. And this is the thing. Actually, two people are fighting with COVID-19 that's right okay and surrounding him there you see or her there you see the uh, COVID-19 coronavirus are, are <coughs> actually been surrounding them that's good okay uh, so probably you can understand the word insist is your word there and then I will show you another picture is there wow and what is the boy doing what is the boy doing can you please explain the picture a uh, corona, right? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Corona is about the. <coughs> Achha, the police are insisting, the doctors are insisting uh, us to wear the mask now. At time, this time is very dangerous. Whenever we will go out of home, we must mask. Okay, it will somehow prevent us from the coronavirus. He is begging. Oh, how is it possible? Yoga. So. <coughs> Okay, yoga, they are insisting from Rwanda. They are insisting, not actually. They are wearing masks to prevent coronavirus. And doctors are insisting us. And uh, police, uh, police are insisting us, right? Okay. So, <coughs> uh, here you see the boy is exercising, you can say, right? The boy is exercising. And uh, what is the boy doing? The boy is bending his body, right? The boy bends himself. Himself. The boy bends himself and the word for you is here bend. Bend manu je bakano. Bend ortho bakano. So uh, lean in a particular direction. Je connector nidishto dikhe ba je kono dikhe. Helano ba baka. Hoi take a bend and the boy bends himself. So there are three, all these three words you can understand that and keep in you keep them in your mind. Yeah, in your memory. First word is ruffled and second word is insist and the third one is been probably it's clear to you and you have understood all of these three words okay let's go next right he is probably in a gym or like that so let's go to the text now read the text and we'll learn about how or what happened to Faravi uh, that so that um, he was very sad so let's listen to the story now okay thank you so Faravi was sitting, bending his head down. 
তাহলে ফারবি ওয়াজ সিটিং বসে ছিল এবং বেন্ড হিজ হেড ডাউন মানে তার মাথা নত করে বসে ছিল হি লুকড স্যাড তাকে খুব স্যাড লাগছিল অ্যান্ড হিজ হেয়ার ওয়াজ আনটিডি অ্যান্ড রাফেল এবং তার চুলগুলো খুব অগোছাল এবং অপরিচ্ছন্ন ছিল ইট ওয়াজ ক্লিয়ার হি ডিড নট ব্রাশ ইট এট অল এবং দিস ওয়াজ ভেরি ক্লিয়ার টু এনি পার্সন এনি ওয়ান দ্যাট হি ডিড নট ব্রাশ ইট এট অল ওকে তার মানে এই জাস্ট লুকিং অ্যাট ওর রিডিং অ্যাবাউট দ্য অ্যাপিয়ারেন্স অফ অ্যাপিয়ারেন্স অফ ফার অফ ইউ ক্যান ইজিলি আন্ডারস্ট্যান্ড দ্যাট ফার অফ ইউ ওয়াজ রিয়েলি ভেরি 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 স্যাড ওকে and now the question why he was he very sad so let's see then what happened farvi are you okay ex flora flora ever farvi ke jigesh korlo ha ki hocche tumar ha tumi are you okay tumi ki thik acho so i'm so shocked flora i don't want to talk ami kotha bolte chai na because uh, uh, he was very shocked so farvi said said farvi okay shock means disheartened uh, i was very hurt okay man amar khub koshto pachhi mon kharab so i am very upset so please don't talk with me okay but you have to but you have to kintu tomake to obosshoi kotha bolte hobe any pain or sorrow is like a mind ar je kono dukkho ba koshto hocche je amader moner moddhe ekta bojha you understand it's a kind of load in a mind and if you tell or share it with your parents or friends ebong tumi jodi seta tumar baba ma'r sathe ebong bondhuder sathe share koro it will be lighter eta ki hoye jabe halka hoye jabe as i have just told you just showing some of the pictures ebong amra dekhte pacchi ager je chobi gulo dekhalam shekhane kintu amra emon ti korechi je jokhon koshto chilo ba dukkho chilo sei dukkho ta ke abar baba ma'r sathe share kore amra ki korbo amader dukkho ta ke komiye felbo right so at the same thing uh, flora is saying flora says je any pain or sorrow is like a load in the mind and if you tell or share it with your parents or friends it will be lighter it ta ki hoye jabe halka hobe on the other hand if you don't share it the load will become heavier and more painful ebong tumi jodi tomar dukho ta ke karo sathe share na koro tahole ki hobe eta kintu aro bere jabe eta kintu aro painful hoye so please tell me what's wrong tahole flora insisted flora ta ki insist korte laglo je obosshoi tomar ki hocche seta amake bolo Faravi looked at Flora and said, "Ever Faravi, Flora dikha thakalo abong chinta kollo thake bollo. One of my friends, Harun, is our school football team leader. Ta hole tarik jon bondhu ase. What is his name? His name was. His name was. Uh, right. His name was Harun. Right. So Harun is the." captain or the leader for school football team leader so yesterday he just dropped his name from the coming inter class football tournament and what did harun do harun just dropped the name of farvi from the list of the players of the inter class football tournament theke tar naam ta bad diye diyeche and i wanted to know why ebong take ami jante chechilam keno amar naam bad diyecho but he didn't even talk to me about it যা এবং সে আমার উত্তরে আসলে আমাকে কোনো কিছুই সে আমাকে জানায়নি বা কিছু বলতে চায়নি সো অফকোর্স দিস ইজ এ গ্রেট শক গ্রেট শক ফর ফার আভি বিকজ ফার আভি ওয়াজ ড্রপড হিজ নেম ওয়াজ ড্রপড ফ্রম দ্য ইন্টার স্কুল ইন্টার ক্লাস ফুটবল টুর্নামেন্ট প্রবলি ইউ ক্যান আন্ডারস্ট্যান্ড দ্যাট হোয়াই ফার আভি ওয়াজ স্যাড রাইট আচ্ছা কি লিখেছ Okay now the question we got the we got the passes about and you probably you are ready with your question with, with your with your uh, right with your pen and paper you can also write down in the comments so let's start this so here you see the first which of the which is the correct statement here farbi was standing up looking down or looking happy Uh, so you please write down the answer everyone please write down the answer there you see that's good i'm getting some of the answers but actually everyone please write down the your answer uh, b ba likhecho i'm sorry pushan so you write it in english no problem so yeah uh, all of you are writing down thank you very much thank you very much
your answer right so let's see which is the correct statement here farabi was looking up looking down or looking happy and b is the right answer that's relation b is your right answer looking down because why was he looking down because he was very sad he was very upset uh, he was his name was dropped from the interclass football tournament so uh, he was very upset with your friend Harun right that's me the whenever we become sad actually we just uh, we just look down right I'm our head so the next question is before you let's see why was Farabi bending his head down now the question because he was unhappy it was his habit or he had a headache so the question is before you probably you can just read the text there and you please write it down yes some of you think the answer that's good congratulations for your answer yeah that's fine wonderful everyone please participate and write down your answer why was Farvi bending his head down? Because a number he was unhappy because he was his habit at a hobby now. He had a headache, shit out noise. So the right answer is of course he was unhappy is the right answer. That's good. That's wonderful. Thank you. And next we are going for the next question is before you here. You see, his hair was ruffled. Here ruffle means brushed and tidy, clear and smooth, and un not brushed or combed. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's good. You have written down. Thank you very much for your answer has nine So not brushed or combed is the right answer Thank you very much for your the your answer is correct. Okay, great And then question number four is before you here. You see Farabi did not want to talk to Flora Farabi did not want to talk to Flora. So what happened because uh, What's the reason of it? Something has said happened to him or he stopped talking to his friend he was unwell and sick so what will be the right answer i'm just waiting for your answer please write it down something sad happened to him that's wonderful thank you very much for your right answer and that's good the right answer is absolutely your answer that you need to know something sad him and you know what is that something because his name was dropped from the interclass football to Harun. that's why this thing happened and he is looking so sad he's bending his head down in front of flora and he is looking so sad okay and even he didn't want to talk to flora for that next question is before you there so please tell me what's wrong flora insisted so here insisted means what insisted means what since insisted man is called or demanded or shouted scolded man also a boka there are demanded man also the economy to chawa the court court the ball and shouted man chit kakora so which one is the right answer would you please write down is called it oh my goodness has nine is called man also the kauke boka the fathers uh, or fathers usually is called their children baba bishiva khetri bishi waka dai ami jai na matho madhe maira hoy to ami bishi waka dai so ke bishi waka dai so write it down acha okay so uh, you have written down a you have written down a probably is not the right answer okay let's see yeah demanded is your answer those who have written down be absolutely correct answer congratulations for it thank you very much for your right answer yeah b is the right answer absolutely next question is b for you say your pain in the mind will be dash if you talk about it with your friend so your pain in the mind will be happy your pain in the mind will be less happy or your pain in the mind will be more happy so what will be the right answer now and my father never calls me that's great wonderful uh, <coughs> of course someone is called to you either your father or mother if your father is called to you then your mother remains silent and your mother remains is called to you then your father remains silent. Sometimes, of course that's good Thank you very much. And your right answer is the absolutely correct answer. Less heavy is the right answer. Thank you very, very much for your answer. Thank you. Wonderful. Let me see how I understood the text very well. 
Okay, let's see the next questions before you probably MCQ, the last MCQ questions are before you, which is the correct statement. You will have to find them out. So Farabi was going to play in the inter-class football tournament or Farabi and Harun were not going to play in the inter-class football tournament. Farabi and Harun used to play in the inter-class football tournament. Okay, uh, that's uh, the, the some options are before you. Please write it down. 7C, you have written down Kazi Farad Ahmed. And wonderful, thank you very much for your answer. Yeah, and of course, uh, Farabi and Harun used to play, right? The word there, you see, used to. Maru Pontar, Farabi was going to play. No, 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 he cannot or he is not going to play because uh, he has been his name has been dropped that's why uh, this year he cannot play uh, and C those who have written down C is your absolutely right answer great and wonderful congratulations because Fabian Harun used to play and the word they are used right that's why c is the right answer absolutely you have got your answer thank you very very much and then next i will show you some of the mcq questions that there i have shown you five mcq questions and probably you are ready and write down the answer one by one and first question is here you see his here was anti d ruffled here anti d means what anti d means neat anti d means clean anti d means clear anti d means slovenly slovenly is the answer that's good afternoon thank you very much for writing all of your answers together now this time please write the answer of this question here i see some of your writing okay anti means to me like a for adam i'm sorry baba see like a clear that tool to here here was anti dn ruffled as you see so clear my polish car so in that case i'm sorry your answer you have to think it again shara parvin i'm sorry baba ik to chinta koro panik to chinta koro abata pra idhane ek chalaki korba jokhan e dhorne the four options to mark out the act out or but without to my unknown roots then you will just fine go for the other answers and uh, see uh, the oil to go last look and a bull right of last test to come here feel bit all right options school as test come here feel bit they want to need clean clear solo slovenly so i'm ready to touch you will go to hello to learn brush to look tell a neat hobby not clean hobby not clear hobby not so of course your answer is slovenly is the right answer those who have written down thank you uh thank you very much those who have written down this answer so you go for the next uh question is before you there you see which one of the following words has similar meaning of the word ruffled and ruffled neat clean safe of course disordered those who have written down your answer is correct disordered is the right answer thank you very much and i'm so shocked flora i don't want to talk said far away said far away what does want want mean here so you can have one shop the or to key want what is the meaning of the word want leave protect or sanity and desire so let's see your answer is of course desire is the right answer thank you very much and desire is your answer is correct absolutely correct answer thank you uh raskar you see uh, is it orthi Acha. and then uh, <clears throat> Thank you. And if you tell or share it to your parents or friends, it will lighter. What does the what does parents mean? You can parents or toki. This is so easy indeed, of course. That's the thing that is father and mother. Absolutely right answer. Thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. How are you? Uh, 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 Orthi, congratulations, Orthi, for getting GP5, golden GP5 in your SC exam from Raju Guttura Model College. And I, I really appreciate that. Appreciate your uh, uh, hard work. Appreciate your uh, working so hard, and you have what you have done. That means you have got a good result for it. And really, I appreciate for it. Thank you very much. 
okay <coughs> so let's see and then the answer uh, if you don't share it the load will become heavier or more painful here uh flora insisted so what's the meaning of uh, what's the meaning of painful is here yes your answer is correct bitter the right answer bitter 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 experience painful experience right you can understand the similar word of painful is bitter is the right answer great thank you so i'll go for some other mcq questions so they are please um, write it down write it down um, I, thank you baba uh, write it down i'm so shocked so i don't want to talk said far away so the meaning of the word shocked here means what so here you see heart shaked or mocked and raked so there's words you can easily understand them and just uh, go for the right answer what you think is correct so what is similar word shocked that is the right answer absolutely is the right answer thank you how was is here uh, there is another question for you question that is before you that's wonderful please acha thai bad is friendly plus pi acha pete pare actually amra to sometimes we think the student is good or bad we don't know what she studies for the test uh, probably uh, uh, you don't know class a do rule thackley they will be the good student not that actually some of the student who can work hard beyond your eyes right beyond the mat beyond what do you see amraja dekhi tar bairo hoyto she porishom korte pare will appreciate those who have made the good result good i plus of course it's not so easy for getting a plus uh you know from the science group or any group i think this is very important those who have got a plus of course they have worked hard so we'll appreciate them all the more right so thank you we must baba and here how yes the raffle is your right answer thank you very much the right answer thank you very very much for it and the teacher of school football the leader of the school football team was harun faravi teacher of flora so okay and that's the right answer that you have written down yes nine number a almost all of you are written down harun absolutely so easy question and the last question is here Faravi shared his problem with uh with Faravi's father Faravi's mother flora and harun so the right answer that is, the flora is your right answer so congratulations for your writing all of your answers great and uh, absolutely you have written down for the network being slow actually you must have some problems but we will have to endure that right as we are living in such a country where network connection is really is hardly uh, got correctly that's why we will have to endure them right so the next questions there are another five questions for you is here so we'll have to write down quick we'll have to finish the so there you see the word interclass means what interclass interclass means uh, no on classes in classes or between schools or between classes so i'm sorry for the network actually but uh, I have nothing to do because Wi-Fi connection is sometimes uh, disturbing us a lot. Okay, no problem. Those who can see the screen, you please write it down. Write down the answer. Stopping and starting. Oh, I'm really sorry. It will be okay you just wait you just wait for a bit uh, you just look at the options there okay so the word interclass here means what you have written down now okay it will be okay sometimes because the network problem so it creates a problem for us this is very natural so we have nothing to do right your answer is correct between classes is your right answer not inter school so here you see uh, the interclass means between classes as you have sometimes interclass football hockey right 
so that means uh, the uh, tournament or the game takes place uh, in classes different classes right so the word tournament here means a contest tournament means contest and the word bent as you know so you go for your answer number 13 there the word bent means band and actually lean line and shape so what will be the answer then right lean is your right answer thank you very much thank you for your answer correct answer right so the next word the word share means what share means divide share means divide that's good uh, divide is the right answer sorry uh, 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 there you have written down a not no 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 share means divide share mano hote je bhag kore na bhag kore na hote je divide kora right probably you can understand not part part is not the right answer and the last number is here we mean bulky and probably your answer is correct thank you very much for writing all of your correct answers okay so we have solved there 15 name questions right and that's really wonderful thank you and there is there are again five questions here you see uh, i saw many students on the school campus here campus means what yeah uh, you please no 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 so we went through I'm sorry, So right. So we'll go for uh, our uh, grammatical topic here. So this is very, very, very important. So you will have to keep it in mind. So today our grammar topic is it uh, got to dinner class, right? Uh, last slide actually that was the class part of the earlier day, no problem. So today here you see. Uh, conditionals so another um, sentence model we'll see a passenger model there are some conditional sentences so you can understand conditionals maniki conditionals mano hocche je amra kono shorto dibo she shorter phole ekta kaj hoy jemon tumi jodi amake help koro tahole amio tomake help korbo right so that means this is a condition right so this is called in english grammar this is called conditional as you see there's four third conditionals three conditionals are there tinta conditional roche uh, conditional as you see the first conditional is before you so be careful this is very important okay so if you uh, if plus subject plus v1 thakle in the conditional sentence get a conditional clause it is the whole body I'm going to have a subject for a shell will cannot have a me plus view on boss at all right and one you can write down a sentence of none thank you very much for writing one sentence you can also write it down if you do I'll do right if you go there I will just uh, go there okay so probably that's right sentence and just this first condition you be careful about the structure of it so if you put a present indefinite tense tackle for Hello, will can or may plus v1 right and your second conditional is there if you put a subject to the v2 high or past tense take the whole number subject about would could might it put a v1 possible and these would could might are called model auxiliary verb and this is conditional see sometimes it's a conditional so wala hai the whole number e duda we can find out the difference can you please write one example of second conditional second conditional act of the horn like the barbecue I want to see uh, would you please write down one example for it <clears throat> and there I see uh, you see uh, C is there uh, degree class to corner what's about tumra you will just go uh, to the classes degree are to mother uh, dear students of class 7 tumra amar YouTube channel a uh, they playlist pull act option at city cuts a photo my home that for a video that for a playlist that for a channels it will come call the option at the tumra playlist a job a playlist to other class wise class globe a corridor huh tomorrow can a child a actually class 7 a shop blue class dictate about the first Paper all the code of the second paper all the code of the class wise uh, videos glow of code of the so it will be so easy for you right right if i was rich uh it takes a unusual uh, 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 uh 
যেটাকে আনরিয়েল পাস্ট বলা হয় দ্যাটস হোয়াই তোমাকে আনরিয়েল পাস্টে সব সময় সাবজেক্টের পর ওয়্যার বসে হাসনাইন ইফ আই ওয়্যার রেস হবে তোমরা একটু ওয়্যার এটা ঠিক করে নাও হ্যাঁ এইগুলো হচ্ছে যে কন্ডিশনালস যেগুলো দিয়ে কন্ডিশন সেন্টেন্স তৈরি করতে হয় and the third conditional is there for a subject about had plus v3 thakle she can output code might have plus v3 bojbe probably you can understand these three conditionals among a third number conditional are it a similar structure role to get a key ortho progress corner she told to get had plus subject plus v3 thakle subject root code might have plus v3 was a toy probably you can understand please act to have a look and skip it in your mind i will go for one exercise for that so be careful about that if uh, when there is subject if you put a subject v1 that means present form of the verb tag be to come on the point on she subject to put a can shall will can of me plus v1 was to have a next we will see jay if you put a subject of a v2 johan tag be jay take a second conditional ball out to hunt that for a game the subject of a wood could might plus v1 was to have a among that with third conditional number of parts if you put a subject to put a hat plus v3 money if you put a past perfect tense johan tag be on a point on she subject to put a wood could might have plus v3 was to have a among a key to third conditional like to one group structure to achieve it again sometimes i say one should done to write so third conditional let a key or to third conditional get to me about a replace quote the power may have a use quote the power shit out to jail हेड आगे दिए देखो इस एंड से सी और डी एर मध्य डिफरेंस टा होते हैं जो सी ते इफ आते हैं डी ते इफ नहीं किंतु डी ते इफ फिर ऑर्थो किंतु प्रकाश कोट्स है राइट तब मैंने इफ तो तुले दिए मैं हेड टके सब्जेक्ट टा आगे नहीं गये थी ये भावे किंतु थर्ड कंडीशनल तो इरिकॉर्ड जाए सो अमे एक टक so so i would have gone with you or had you come here i would have you can understand the examples so i'm just going for one exercises there so i will give you some of the fill in the blanks there so you please write down the answer there you see the first sentence is before you if you invite me i add the function if you invite me i attend the function so uh, use the correct form of verb right Correct form of verb the key of the actual set of leak how I get that how J if you invite me I make and I have used the present tense after if if you put a present tense by what let's see so we'll have to write down the next clause right absolutely has nine shall attend that's good I want to see everyone please write it down everyone please write it down I shall attend uh, Maruf that's good yes uh, and then I will give you another sentence here you see if you attended uh, if you attend invited me sorry if you invited me I attend the function so you please write the answer right will attend that's good shall attend that's fine thank you very much so there I have given you another next sentence is before you please write down the answer of the next sentence okay uh, and there i am giving you another sentence that is third sentence there you see if you had invited me i act in the function so and the fourth sentence i am also giving you there so all these four uh, questions are before you four fill in the blanks are before you and you have to fill it up according to the structures right as i have already shown you so um, don't do it emotionally or without knowing the rules please so and mention the number mention the number please otherwise i cannot understand as they're the same type of sentences so you please write down the, write down the number of the question okay. attended hobby would have attended attend attended attended okay so probably you can understand so would have attended hobby not only attend uh jamie would have attend nababa attend with the present tense that would have have a pretty key however past participle form is good to have a that's why perfect passport is the past participle form of the verb right so write your first answer is shall we can or may plus attend you can write down any of the answer then the second answer is would could might plus attend have a or another for third answer is there would would might have attended your answer that's good and the last answer is here would could might have attended again the same answer that my dictator see a d number answer into a key hobby current a duty 
third conditional bala hoche probably you can understand that so really you will just write down all of these rules together these four conditions are very very important for your life that will come later on in your native links classes and uh, and in the next we will go for right form of verbs and there this uh, this uh, this rule will come to a great use to you right so probably you will go through all of these rules you will write them down so thank you very much here uh, today for attending your attending class and thank you especially appreciate your participation there in your homework is uh, you will go to your homework and exercise book and you solve this unseen passages there and uh, of course uh, 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 we'll go for the again for the first paper class and this friday we'll go for the test on english first paper class so see you on the next class thursday and thank you bye bye allah peace so see you uh, then okay stay at home and even fine thank you allah peace